had just parked the car in a two hour spot and as I was walking to work I saw someone about to leave from an unlimited spot and those are the opportunities that you have to grab with all you got so I went back to the car and waited behind that person's car until she left and bang I will not need to come back and move my car. It's a wonderful start to this morning. Not to mention that Amelie woke up much better today, so that was that was wonderful too. It's five, I'm going home a bit earlier than I usually do because Amelie is still sick and we should need to see a doctor apparently. Here in Australia there's this phone number you can call and then they check symptoms and stuff and then they tell you what to do. If you need to go to the hospital, if you need to see a doctor in the next 24 hours, you need to see a doctor and whatever. And they said she needs to see a doctor in two hours. You know, they always choose to be safe. So that's probably, in my opinion, more than what she needs, hopefully. But Shelly did say that she had 40 degrees fever, which is a bit high. But in her age, the temperature doesn't really mean anything. On babies, especially very young babies, the temperature means how bad the situation is. But for older kids and people in general, the temperature doesn't necessarily mean anything. Nevertheless, it is pretty high. So it is a bit concerning. Went home, I'm really still sick. The doctor, we had to call the doctor. The doctor came, one that comes to your house and checked her and apparently she has a nose, throat, ear infection or something like that. So now I'm here at this uh, place over here, the chemist warehouse, it's just a pharmacy, to buy antibiotics. So that's what I'm gonna do. Just waiting for the pharmacist to mix the thing. I have a buzzer. It will buzz when it's ready apparently. Right, here's the thing I failed I failed because yesterday as you can see this is the next day after buying the medicine coming home giving it to her all that kind of stuff putting it to sleep cooked some dinner for us I was so t this whole situation she's good though you good Boa. are you good Boa. Boa. <laughs> She is, she is much better today. But I, I did fail to finish this vlog and, and edit. What? O botão não, não pode apertar o botão agora. She wants, to, she wants to take foot, she's gonna throw a tantrum. But before I finish this vlog that I didn't finish and it's a disaster and I failed already, I just wanna finish my thought about antibiotics. Because antibiotics are really important and people misusing them, like using when they are not necessary, is causing a problem. Why are you looking at me? I'm looking at her. Oh yeah, she she is playing with your with your um, vitamins. And while some people just use antibiotics for everything, I always get suspicious when the doctor says you need antibiotics. But because of she has an infection, so it's likely that she needs them. If it is a bacterial infection and not a viral infection, because you know antibiotics can't be used for virus. If you didn't know that, now you know. That's why people shouldn't take antibiotics when they have a cold or they have a flu because the flu is a virus. It doesn't, doesn't do anything. But as I was saying, the benefits of using outweigh the risk of not using because... No, no, no. The risk of not using is higher than the benefit of not using. You know what I mean? It's just it could be a bacterial infection it could spread so the doctor said it's good to use it we're going to our family doctor this morning and that's why I'm not at work yet but that's something for tomorrow anyway thanks so much for watching and I will see you today I mean tomorrow tomorrow for you today for me all right bye my favorite car from the yourself broken fidget toy of Brooklyn is there's so many that I'm just gonna make, I'm gonna comment on many of them since this video is short. My sister says, if you hadn't left Brazil, you wouldn't be suffering jet lag. That's right, it's a good argument. Maybe next time I'll stay. Silver Show Robbie says, <laughs> I like how you, like, you're not joking, right? You're not joking. But then, <laughs> after Brooklyn tells me that he's about to vomit, we argue if it's on the left, on the right. <laughs> it's really important to be accurate, all right? All right. Rebecca Uber says, I'm not sure if that's even possible, but the Sunday vlog is even more random than normal. Do not doubt my randomness 
possibility ability and then Brooklyn says if Carlos had energy he would help me but he didn't so he's a loser I think he was gonna vomit I helped you I let we left as soon as possible after we finished that argument about if he was left or right Alfie P says I'll buy the fidget spinner you mean the one I, I made maybe I'll give it away <laughs> maybe and then Max Biz says dear Carlos you have to review English turn on English subtitles and tell me what you read from 649 to 52 unfortunately I'm not gonna tell you what I read um, because maybe YouTube will flag this video as not being family friendly and then I'll lose ad revenue, you know? But anyone is free to go and check it out. 